So you're joining me now here in Mini Europe. So I did a combi ticket, as I explained earlier, for €32.50 for each of us. And I think that's a really good price to get both of the attractions for definite. You can see the Atomium from here, so I'm definitely going to share all of that with you. <laughs> It's going to take us to the Atomium and I keep referring to it little, sorry I said little Europe, it's actually mini Europe which apparently is next to the Atomium so I think it's exactly in the same area, hence why we're doing both attractions together. I'm going to take you around all of the attractions here, obviously I'm not going to share with you every single one of them just because the vlog would be far too long but I'm definitely going to share with you some of the iconic ones, it looks really good so let's go explore mini Europe. I'm here on the UK, London one. Listen. Oh, that's so really cool. Look how detailed this is.
Back in the hotel room now, I didn't actually finish off what I sort of felt in terms of our review of the Mini Europe, so I thought I'd just have a really quick chat here with you now. Um, so Mini Europe, I just thought it was really good. A really good day out, and I think definitely for children as well, even for adults. I mean, we were obviously just, you know, a couple going on our own, but it was really interesting knowing a little few facts about, you know, different places, um, and just seeing everything, you know, all the different attractions there. You definitely need a good day for it. Obviously, you can't control the weather, but had we have been doing the attractions of the Atomium and the Mini Europe today, then it's raining. So, you know, it wouldn't have been as good. So definitely, if obviously, if you can, I mean, if you're booking things ahead like we did, you just can't guarantee the weather. It's always better if it's sunny or, you know, at least dry because everything there is all, you know, to see. It's not, nothing's really undercover or anything. So it would definitely kind of ruin your experience of it. But again, you can't control that. So we had a wonderful time at Mini Europe. Highly recommend it and definitely the combi ticket that I've been talking about uh, with the Atomium attraction as well is definitely highly recommended but that would definitely be a top tip from me in terms of doing that together because I think you save that bit of money and getting those two attractions for that price I think is really really good so definitely mini Europe was definitely unique you know really interesting in terms of an attraction so I highly recommend that this is a five-star hotel if you're interested I'm not sure which way around the videos are going to be um, but definitely if it's not already on the playlist it will be coming up next so definitely check out my five star hotel um, review here in Brussels Le Plaza Hotel is what it's called and I've also done a food and drink video again it might already be out on the channel or it might be coming out next definitely check that out as well that's our top five things um, to eat and drink here in Brussels we've had a wonderful time in Brussels we'll definitely return and next time we might come here with Emily obviously our teenage daughter if you're new to our channel you won't know who Emily is but she's the other half of the brownie life our teenage 
teenage daughter. This was just a couple's trip. We've just been here for a couple of nights, you know, a couple of days, and it's been absolutely wonderful. We've thoroughly enjoyed our time here in Brussels, and we will definitely return. It's a beautiful city, really loved it, and as I say, we'd bring Emily next time. Definitely subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Give this video a really big like, and I'll see you on the next one, everyone. Bye.